हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ऑटोमेशन कम्युनिटी इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट नैंड गेट वी गॉट टू नो हाउ टू ड्रॉ लैडर लॉजिक फॉर नैंड गेट टूडे इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट एक्सोर गेट एक्सक्लूसिव और गेट वी विल गेट टू नो हाउ टू इंप्लीमेंट एक्सक्लूसिव और गेट सो लेट स्टार्ट The output of a two input exclusive or gate will be on when one input is on and other input is off otherwise when both inputs are at same status then output will be off as you can see in the table when both the inputs are in same state the output is in false state and here both the inputs are in true state same state so the output is also false state and when the status of two inputs is different one is in false state and another is in true state the outputs are in true state so let's move to eco structure machine expert there we will draw a ladder logic for exclusive or gate so let's start we will open eco structure machine expert firstly we will keep read protection as inactive and write protection as inactive as well and then click on apply now we will go to configuration tab there we can select a logic controller i will select tm221c24r i will click on it and drag it to here do you want to replace yes then i will go to serial line and select the protocol as tmh2gdb and then click on apply now i will go to programming tab we can also click on this option for a full screen mode i will click on it and i can also zoom into it so to draw ladder logic for exclusive or gate i will be using normally open contacts as well as normally close contacts so firstly i will select a normally open contact i will click here then a normally close contact i will click on it and then click here i will take another normally open contact and then click here and a normally close contact and then click here so i will select a coil i will click on it and then click here so we have added two normally open contact and two normally close contacts and one coil so we need to connect this normally open contact and normally close contact to the coil so i will click on this and draw a line like this now we need to assign address to the contacts i will click on it and type as i 0.0 and assign address to the normally close contact as i 0.1 then i will assign this normally open contact as i 0.1 and i 
0.0. So then I will add symbol. For normally open contact, I will add switch 1. I will click yes. Then I will add symbol to this contact as switch 2. Click yes. So switch 1 as normally open contact switch 2 as normally close contact here switch 2 as normally open contact and here switch 1 as normally close contact so these are in parallel switch 1 and switch 2 are in series switch 1 and switch 2 are in series and switch 1 switch 2 and switch 2 switch 1 are in parallel now we need to assign address to the coil as q 0.0, .0. and I will assign a symbol as LED. I will click on yes. So, as we are drawing ladder logic for exclusive OR gate, so for two inputs, only one input should be in true state so that output will be in true state. If, if both the inputs are in true state, then the output will be in false state and if both the inputs are in false state then also led will be in false state so for led to be in true state only one input either switch one or switch two should be true so that led will be in true state we will exit full screen mode and we will compile the program. Now we will go to commissioning and launch simulator. Now we will start controller. To do so, click OK. So here, as you can see, both the inputs switch 1 and switch 2 are in false state and the LED, the output is also in false state. And if I modify switch 1 as true, as I have modified only one input as true. The output will also be true. And if I modify switch 2 only as true, the LED will also be in true state. And now I will modify both the inputs as true. The output will be in false state. So here, when I have activated switch 1 only, the current will flow through it. And switch 2 is normally close contact here, so the current will also pass through it and the LED will be in true state. And when I modify switch 2 as true, the switch 1 is in true state. The switch 2 is also in true state as it is a normally close contact. When I modify it as true, the current will not pass through it and LED will not be in true state. It will be in false state. Similarly, from here, when switch 2 is in true state, as it is a normally open contact, the current will flow through it. Here, Switch 1 is in true state as it is a normally close contact. On modifying it to true, the current will not pass through it and LED will not be in true state.
it will be in false state. It was all about exclusive OR gate. Thank you for watching.